I don't have a problem. I'm just saying one more question about Phil Palmer and I'm taking this off and the interview is over. What about women? Um, you have to help me here. I'm a scientist. What about women? Oh, I think Avery's quite a good looking guy, but I tell you, version 43 broke a lot of, a lot of hearts in his time, I think. What about relationships with women? Um, relationships can be a bit tricky, really, because every now and then he, he does get blown up and reassembled. No, 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 it's okay. I get asked about Avery Keats and romance a lot, so I've actually uh, created a presentation for just such occasions. Science has proven that Avery Cates is so attractive to women he actually destroys all women that he comes in contact with through sheer sexual charisma. A quick study of his books also demonstrates that Avery Cates, unlike the Cyb version 43, is capable of love and other human emotions, and only the cold and caring cruelty of the cosmos prevents him from experiencing the delicate bloom of romance. Version 43 can peel itself like a fruit, which has performed badly with women in polls determining desirable physical traits in potential lovers. You have a fundamental difference in the, in the whole anatomy and physiology. Cybernetic penis, human penis, no contest. Yeah, maybe. I thought I'd stop thinking, I thought oh, I just can't go on, it'd be more fun. <laughs> <laughs>